Hey there everyone, my name is Moku Shepard from the Guys of Games. Back with some more Paper Mario TTYD Hero Mode. And hey look, since we did the Bowser part finally, Bowser's actually on the title screen, which is kind of cool. Although his art's different, I think that's his art from like Super Paper Mario. I think. Actually, I'm not even sure about that, but it's from somewhere, I don't know. Because, uh, I mean, I don't know. It's, co it's cool that this game does this, you know what I mean? Uh, I didn't have to go to that much effort. It's kind of surprising, actually. But, uh, I digress. So, in the downtime between chapters here, uh, I went ahead and did some stuff. Mainly, I bought, like, I basically went and grabbed everything I could possibly grab. Which included enough shine spreads to get all the partners upgraded. Which is pretty nice. So, uh, Koops has this iron shell. I assume that that HP indeed- I haven't used this yet, but I'm assuming it's like the the shell has 8 health and 2 defense. That's what those stats are, I assume. And then F Flurry gets her uh, Frostbite. Which is pretty much- I think this is basically exactly the same as the original. Uh, she's, Yeah, she's weak to fire and explosions. That's interesting. I kind of like that the, all the partners are getting like, uh, like certain weaknesses. That's interesting. I always thought it'd be interesting for that, just because like Bobbery exists and he's like a bomb on, but he doesn't really have any of the bomb on weaknesses that are, exist in like every other Paper Mario game, right? No fire damage, no lightning damage, no uh, any of that bogus. Uh, but yeah, I got them all upgraded, so they all have extra attack power and stuff. And I got some items. So I, since uh, we had Zesty unlocked, I went ahead and cooked up all the stuff I could find that would reasonably be able to cook into stuff. Nothing, everything was basically like it cooked into what you would expect it to, right? Mushroom to a shroom fry and everything. Everything cooked into like the same items that didn't, weren't changed. The one item that is changed for some reason is the fried egg now restores a whopping 25 HP and 15 FP. And I thought, well, hell, I kind of have to keep that just because that's such a glow up. Like, that's a big increase. Uh, I fiddled around. When I, I fought a couple encounters, so, like, I leveled up. So I have, uh, you know, 19 BP now. But uh, something I found out is that Slow Stopper actually still can kill stuff instantly. It's just very unlikely. But it does, like, like when I was running through Chapter 2, for example, and, like, backtracking through there to look for stuff. Uh, it's slow stop. It was like killing the Lakitu's, which is surprising. Because it does not mention it at all. It just says, yeah, it can slow them down. But to be fair, I guess it doesn't mention the attack down either, huh? Oh, that cookbook. But yeah, I went ahead and grabbed all these badges. Defend plus P is still 5, so it's still kind of like I'm not going to bother using that. I got Lucky Day, and what else did I grab? I think I grabbed, what was it from Dazzle, the Feeling Fine, yeah. That's all I had basically star pieces for. And then I grabbed a bunch of other badges, like basically grabbed every badge that was in the badge shop that was like reasonably like something I'll probably actually use. And basically this is what I have equipped right now, which seems maybe a bit like stat heavy. The, the thing is, is that I don't have... Like, I keep going back to Slow Stomp, because Slow Stomp's just so good. Like, it, it's just a strong hit, and also it can just paralyze stuff. And it's like, okay, well, I'm going to keep using that, you know what I mean? Like, and it's so much cheaper than everything else. Like, it's 1 BP. Like, Silver Smash is stronger, but it's 3 BP. And it's not even that much stronger right now. I'm sure once the hammer upgrade gets added in, you know, once future chapters get added, and Silver Smash and all everything else will go up for we're in a, a point right now where jump is just better pretty much so uh i'm gonna keep happy heart p on because yeah i noticed that yeah now it's guaranteed one hp for turn which makes it so much better because now it's reliable which is fantastic i got lucky day which is awesome lucky day is only one more bp than pretty lucky so like i might as well use that right uh, and otherwise, yeah, I put on the super appeals because there's really not much else I can do. Like, I could theoretically put on, like, FP drain. That, that would make Goombella kind of useless. Well, not useless, useless, but, like, 
actually thinking about it, that's not a terrible idea. Goombella has plus one at base, and she has plus one at super, but with power, the PFD down, she does get two. So she would actually be able to multi bonk and regular bonk just fine with that. That's interesting. That's something to keep in mind, because I do have HP drains. I can make Goombella into like a pseudo tank. Just slap on an HP drain and an FP drain and just bump up her attack power a bit, and then she just heals off any damage. Uh, I mean, mm. like power rush is interesting because it's thirty percent. It's thirty percent or thirty-five percent. I remember being thirty-five percent, but maybe it's just thirty percent. Because right now Mario has uh, twenty HP. So that means he goes into danger at 6 HP. Which is around the point where he could take a hit. But, like, we just don't have enough, like, defense. Like, there's just not enough ways to, like, reduce damage, I feel like. To reasonably use this yet. As soon as there's, like, a, I don't even know if there, there's plans to add Last Stand and whatnot later on. But, like, Last Stand alone would make it way more feasible. But then again, I guess it kind of encourages you to upgrade your HP more. Because, like, if I had 30 HP... Uh, danger would be 9 HP, which is actually, like, pretty good. In the context of this. Um, trip on it be up to down? Nah. I think Mario's HP is more important, so... Him being frail kind of sucks. I could put on Simplifier. Uh... You know, just for fun, we'll put on Simplifier, screw it. I don't know what's actually ha gonna happen when we enter here, though, is the thing. Like, I fought some of the, the Magic Koopas down there, and it's like, okay. But, like, I, I don't know, you know what I mean? An eerie new cutscene. It's kinda cute. Hmm. It's playing that music from earlier. That? Huh. What? What is it gonna be like? Is Bowser still here? We just... Is that like the joke? I mean, what else could it be? Because it was like the... It was like some Koopa dudes, right? Oh, yeah. Well, there you go. I'm guessing this is gonna be new dialogue then, because this is all brand new, so... So, <laughs> you'll be dog food. So I guess, for some reason, Bowser's hanging out with the, the Mafia, I guess, whatever. <laughs> Picking on someone not his size. That's funny. I'm kind of, oh, bleh, bleh. I should have had Goombella out. Well, dang. I guess screw it. Who, who needs the tattle? Oh, what? My Lucky Star P didn't do anything. That happens sometimes. I don't know how having multiple Lucky Starts on works, but sometimes the game's weird about that. Um. I guess I'll just... I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna like uh, fire flower and then ether flower, and the idea is that uh, actually, should I? I'm gonna put Flurry out front. We'll have her do it first. It is like uh, burn them, and then hopefully Cammy can't status Bowser for a little while. Cammy just didn't get burned there. Oh, she did fall. Oh, well, that's worth. Do 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 do. I mean, that's assuming it makes them large. Like, who knows? Ah, I think it worked. Okay. Yeah, no, that's like basically exactly the same. Nothing new about that. Well, let's try Frostbite. Uh, I can't... Wait, really? So you put it... So Hammer can hit anyone, but not the move where Flurry flies over to the dude and attacks them. I see. That is, uh... 
kind of funny, actually. Well, um... Let's throw Frostbite. Oh, holy shit! That's why it bonks her... The enemy into... That's really good, actually. God dang. That's hella good. Well, uh... There's not any point in using any of these because they're like status items and they're allergic for a little bit. Yeah, I don't want the mushroom. <laughs> I, I actually didn't. I couldn't see what it was, so I, I didn't see what it was. But whatever. Well, we'll oh, I can't slow stop for them. Should I just? I guess I can just sweet treat. We're missing a bit of HP and FP, so whatever. Ah, that was a decent sleep treat. Actually, almost got max FP from that. What is that? That's a new attack. Hey, I made a waste of turn though. I'm glad I did that. Holy baloney though. What the heck was that? <laughs> That's funny. Okay, well, she shrunk for two turns, so I'm not going to waste time attacking with her. I guess I can just have her appeal then. I guess I'll just... Uh... I could sweet treat again, but like that, that feels like a waste. I'm just going to regular jump on Cammy. I'm going to do the smart thing and focus on Cammy. Wahaha. I'm feeling it. Go King Bowser. Rah, rah, rah. Ah, oh, what the? I guess, yeah, she can do that. I didn't think about the part where she can just not use the status. <laughs> she is inclined to heal. I think her AI is, like, really, like, heavily weighted towards healing, so... Oops. That's fine. I mean, I guess since you're, uh... Since you're still shrunk, I can just do this. She can heal one way or another. Oh, that didn't poison? Really? Huh. I'm still gonna focus on you. Maybe Cammy's just really resilient to status effects, given that she's a Koopa. Holy crap, though! That is a new attack, and that is, uh, not fun. And that shrunk her again! I'm just gonna switch. Yeah, we're just gonna switch. Like, she's not doing anything anyways. And hey, I can throw out my stopwatch I got from f for free from, like, a random audience member, right? Maybe this will work, huh? Aw, oh, come on! And she's being a jerk bag too, healing? I see. Well... Uh... Fire shell, then? Yeah, Cammy's just, like, not affected by anything, huh? I mean, <laughs> you know what? Screw it. I bought this Confusing Star from, uh, Mr. Whatchamacallit? Charlatan? Oh, nice! They, they got confused! Cammy's not confused enough to not heal, though. What a little wiener. And then she dropped down. Well, uh, let's Soul Stomp her to knock her back down. And, uh, I guess let's try out this Boo Shroom. It says it heals 10 HP and FP. I've... I've got a feeling that it's a Boo Shroom. It might be a Boo Sheet. Like, that might be the joke. It's just a Boo Sheet that heals you? Like, let's see. Yeah, there you go. Oh, and, oh yeah, right. Yeah, so I uh, I also got uh, I got the cheap curse from uh, what's her face. Oh, and then nobody's gonna attack. Oh, counter, cool. Oh, one turn, huh? I mean, that's not terrible, I guess. 
I can't attack though is the thing because even though Koops is cause Koopas can't attack counter like they're immune to zap tap but counter still gets them hmm I don't want to use up all these items but I mean I don't know I can't do anything else though is the thing I guess this effect, uh, that's not really worth it. Dang. I guess I'm just gonna defend. Man, Bowser's out of it forever. Okay, Kami really likes to heal herself for some reason. This seems like a good time to slow stop her. And hopefully not mess up the buttons. I was doing pretty good when I was doing this solo off recording or whatever <gasps> and that was as soon as i do i'm feeling suddenly bloated and i feel like i'm gonna mess it up <laughs> i'm gonna mess it up just because like I, all of a sudden i got nervous frick well that's fine at least it reduced their attack and then i can just appeal and at least that's doing something jesus man i'm glad i got those uh Whatchamacallitters. I don't even know the word. The the the, the, the defend pluses. Okay, well shrink is just plus minus two, right? So I can still knock her down. And now that Bowser isn't gonna count. <sighs> Hate. There we go. Lucky day finally doing something. Wow, is that all Cammy does? That's really annoying because Bowser keeps <sighs> making it so I can't do anything, huh? Like, well, screw it then. I'm just going to art attack. These guys have been annoying. I'm, yeah, like, I'm, gonna, I'm just literally going to do this. Screw you, Cammy. Okay, at least I didn't miss up any uh, miss any attacks. Hey, nice lucky. Okay, please. Okay, you're still dizzy. God dang, man. I don't want to use a fire shell and then you just miss everyone. But you didn't miss any times. Like, geez, coops. Oh, nice. She's down. Oh, the bite. Okay, well, Bowser got slow. That's pretty good. Since he has defense... Eh, I'll just leave it. We'll just keep attacking. Bro! I should have actually let that hit him, because I could have zapped him. Not that it really matters, but... I mean, you never know. It could have been useful. Uh, I guess I'll try poisoning him. Oh, yeah, that's useful. Boom. That's the first time he's used Fire Breath in, like, how long? Yeah, we're not even going to let that guy do anything. Oh, except he's still going to, so... Get out of here. I guess I should probably sweet treat at this point. I do have the fried egg as like a backup in case things get real spicy. Because that's like an easy to make item, so I don't really care about wasting it, but uh... You know, I'm just gonna so mess up the sweet treat and screw myself. Uh, all the like, all the shrooms are gone! Go buck wild. I'm getting slightly better at the sweet treat, although I'm still, I'm still a little rough around the edges. Guard that, because if they, you don't guard that, Koops gets turbo dicked. Okay. Uh. I mean, we'll just keep going then. Hmm. 
And that extra HP Koops gets from his upgrade is actually so big. Because it's just like, hey, <laughs> now he can take two hits now, guaranteed. I'll try to slow him again. I'm getting better at the stylish. Hey, that's it! That wasn't too bad. It's a lot of experience, too. So now what? Hooray! Okie dokie. What? Oh, okay. And there's Bandy Andy. <laughs> we, we just leave, but like, not that we didn't even get teleported back. I guess I'll sleep. Like, I know, like, I, I mean, I don't know how it's being done. That's the thing. All I know is that everything says, like, yeah, it's, first two chapters are done, and then, like, obviously the pit's done. And then there's the one optional boss, but everything else is the same. Or rather, like, nothing else has been changed, but, uh, like, what's going on over here, you know? I just, let's save. I don't know why, but, like, it just seems like a good time to save. I did just beat Bowser. Who knows, right? I don't suppose the dialogue is different. Uh, nope, looks exactly the same. How about you? Da 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 ba da bo bo. Yeah, no, it looks exactly the same. Okie dokie. Well, I guess we're just walking on back. I wonder if the Koopas are even gonna be gone too. That'd be kind of funny. Sorry, I'm like I'm like half paying attention because my someone's texting me. Do, 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 boop, boop. No, it's the, even the Koopas are gone, huh? Well, I'm glad I fought them while they were still there, then. Do, 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 do. Whoopsie daisy. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. If there's one thing I can say about this mod, I, I've already said this actually many times, but like man, the, the new music is just so cool. It really is. <clears throat> I pressed jump, god dang it. I swear sometimes, like there's like this weird thing where like, I don't know how to describe it, but it's like if you jump too late, like, you, like there's like slightly there's like input delay or like something I don't even know. That's not what it is. It's like, I don't know. It's like in the remake, there's like a thing where like the edges along a lot of things are like more rounded so you'll slide off stuff and that's kind of what it feels like even in this game sometimes. I don't know if that's actually what it is or if, it's, if I'm just crazy, like who knows. All right, my text is going through. And there we go, okay. So you'll talk to the mafia, huzzah. But so f fun thing too is that uh, I was, I grabbed uh, all of the star piece panels I could find. And the one in front of uh, Merlin, Merlon, Merlonly, Merlulu, well, had a uh, shine sprite in it. Oh, a trade-off. I mean, I might as well buy that. I haven't used any of these. I have one in my uh, storage and one. I'm, I guess I'll put this here. Because, uh, I guess I'll do the optional boss. Like, if this is where the game ends, I might as well go do the optional boss. Oh, so here's a fun thing. So this guy, I took this guy's trouble on. And now I've ever talked to him, he's like, find those courage shells, man. He does the courage shell thing every time. And uh, you can actually go buy courage shells. At uh, the the shop in West Rogueport. Guess what? Those aren't actually courage shells. Not originally, so they don't count. I bought five of them, and he didn't say anything to me. Like these, this is not an actual courage shell. It's not the same idea, or whatever. 
I don't know how that works, but regardless, the, it does not apply. I could not give him five courage shells. I'm stuck with that trouble unless I get rid of it. Da da ba ba dee boop doo. Oh, this is different. <laughs> He's lying. Well, take up for the blimp. Uh, okay, so now what? What happens if I, uh, take the blimp? Well, yeah, uh, well, that, that felt like my game crashed there for a sec. It took so long. We can go to Glitzville! Hooray! Does Glitzville... What a time for the thing. Why does it keep doing that when I'm in front of stuff? What's the... What's this? How's life? Goobly's just hanging out with the butterflies. Well, I guess I'll save. I can get a star piece, at least, from this. Hey, that means I can get HP Drain, or a uh, Happy Heart, I mean, for Mario. So where does this go? Does this really just go to Glutzville? Like, I, I don't know. Let me, uh, slow my fan down a little there. Like, what's gonna, what's the shindig, you know? I was off like, like you can literally see that like for some reason one side of the blimp has transparent glass and the other side is just like a gray solid color. Chapter three. Is chapter three just the same then? For guts and glory. Or gory. Well that's not the same. Wait, is this more than chapter two? Does this actually go to chapter three? Or is it just like some things are changed? Like I <laughs> Everything I saw said chapter 3 is not done. It's just the first two. I feel like I've been tricked again. I mean, if nothing else, at least we, at least we have access to it. I don't know. I mean, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, <laughs> it just takes you straight to, uh, never mind, yeah, no, it just takes you straight to the credits. Welp. Uh, that means that, uh, yeah, well, I don't want to watch the whole credits, so we're just going to reset. I guess I'll go do the boss then, why not? Screw it. I have some extra money, so I'll just buy some more items. I have my scrambled egg. <laughs> Doobie dip by bow. I'll grab the thing, because I guess... I guess I'll grab Happy Heart. Like, why not? Because I think the the optional boss is just another blooper fight. I can at least do this though. So yeah, grab this. There you go. That star piece. That for some reason they put that star piece in a star panel, just to the right of the pipe in the remake. For some reason they moved. It. I don't know why they they moved it five inches. I don't get it. It just seems like a weird thing to change. 
Uh, I guess I'll go this way first so I can get the badge. Actually, I'll, you know, here, I'll show you how I uh, grinded some money. Because uh, the Supreme Shrooms in the shop that uh, you can buy, they, they heal 15 HP. And they, they cost like 15 coins. So if you're wondering what those replaced, they replace Altar Shrooms. Which means you can cook these into Shroom Roasts. Which sell for 45 coins, which is obviously a lot more than 15 you pay for it. Which is actually pretty nice. So I guess, I guess I'll show that off. Do papi. I mean, this is probably very much unintentional. It's just, you know, things are very much in an incomplete state. At the end of the day, this is a mod of a game, and it only edits the first two chapters at the moment. So there's a lot of things that need to be done. But uh, yeah, you can cook these up for a decent item. I, I guess I could keep one of these for. Uh, the blooper boss, but I feel like it's better to just buy boo shrooms because boo shrooms heal like 25 HP, 25 FP, and they give you like a boo sheet. Like, that's pretty good. Like, compared to like the stream stake isn't terrible, especially at this point in the game. No, 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 don't, don't, don't eat my down input. Like, 30 HP is just a full heal, and then 10 FP is still a lot. Do, do, boo, boo, do. I could always grind another level to get uh, to use that happy heart, but I don't know. That feels cheesy, as it were. Let's go to the underground shop and we'll call it a. The underground shop is ridiculous. Like now that I'm actually gonna use that stuff, like yeah, I might as well grab it. I think I have some life shrooms in the in the inventory too, so like, I might as well grab those when I'm there too. But uh, let's go grab those, uh, whatchamacallitters. The happy- Also, hey, what, what about Charlatan? What do you got? <laughs> a coin! Wow, I guess I'll buy it. The, the stupid special card is still in here. It says it lets you play- Like, I guess you can buy this so you don't have to do the trouble. Which is actually kind of cool. I kind of like that. Because I always thought it was a little weird that, like, you, you get all the cards just from doing random troubles. But, like... Where do those people get those cards from? How the hell do they end up with these cards that let them gamble at the Mafia Casino? And one of them's owned by a kid. So, like, he, she can't really use that, surely, right? Like, am I crazy? I don't know. Alright, so I can get Happy Heart. If I got one more star piece, I could get one of these. But, like, is that really worth it? Double to, and like these are all like I guess if you saved up all your star pieces you could probably get explosive touch. But eh I'm not interested in that. I will grab Happy Heart. Boom. There we go. Now let's change my badges up here. So I can take off. If I just take off Simplifier, sure. We'll keep Lucky Start on, and we'll just take the P off, because it doesn't really matter much for the partner. Also, it's a blooper boss. I know it's a blooper boss, so I'm going to take off the jump. I'm going to put on, like, Hammer Throw or something. Uh, where's my HP? Happy Heart, there you go. Let me see. Do we have Piercing Throw? Yeah. Because I don't think Mario really has any other ways to hit an enemy on the ceiling. Because I'm going to try a cheese strat out. Because I know that I haven't seen the actual fight in like happen. But I do know that it can be a little rough when, when it falls down and just starts attacking. So I'm going to put on P up D down actually. Actually maybe not. I think it should be fine without it. Actually hmm. Actually, you know what? Nah, we'll keep P up D down. Yeah, that makes sense. And I'll keep the happy hearts on. That's good, consistent healing. Do, do, do. Boo! 
I guess I'll try to heal that. I am missing two HP. That then that will end up mattering if I don't heal that. I know it for a fact because that's just how it always seems to go. So I guess I'll heal the end quickly. Uh, I guess while we're there, I'll show off the bad shop. Like I said that I bought everything, and I just want to make sure that like it's well known that I did. I think there's like one thing in there I could have maybe bought. Like I think uh, peekaboo's in there, but peekaboo still cost BP. I'm pretty sure so. I'm not gonna bother. It, 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 it's one, that's one of those like interesting things to know. Like you could make peekaboo free, and just call it a quality of life thing. But there is some value in no, being able to know exactly how much HP something has. Yeah, this is all that's in here, and I already have a super appeal because I got it from the casino. One BP to use peekaboo. Like I just don't need that. Oh, hey, Charlatan, did you talk? update? He's got another Supreme Shroom. <laughs> well, that's actually more expensive than the West Rogue Port Shop, but I'm still gonna, I, like, screw it, I'm gonna buy it and sh cook it, just because, like, why not? It's there, get rid of that inventory. Just because I think it's funny. And also, because I might, really, I really do probably gonna need some money, because the stuff in the underground shop is not cheap it's all like 100 to 200 coins stop so like i need money also i guess we'll put out to flurry because she's gonna be the key to this strat because it's a uh it's a blooper fight so it's hanging out in the ceiling for the first part of the fight and what i i'll explain it later but basically we're gonna take advantage of how the fight works basically right because you know in the in the og game right the idea is you take out the tentacles and the blooper falls to the ground i i'm not sure if that stars stars shine spray is even gettable it might just be there for funny fees. i don't know maybe i'm crazy there might be somebody to get i don't know but uh well you'll well, you know I'll, I'll mention it when we get to the actual fight like let's let's worry about that later and it's here. This here's the delicious shop. Look at all this stuff. Oh, it's actually not as expensive as I remember. But uh, we'll sell all this. It's decent selling stuff. I did some. Uh, if you're curious, by the way, I never grabbed the chest from Flurry's house, and it was a uh, a gold bar of all things. So we'll buy some a dark boo shroom. Sure, we'll get like a mega shroom. Uh, let me withdraw because I have my life shrooms. I wonder if earthquake works on the tentacles. I got this from uh the shop. How many items do I have? I have room for four more items. Like I might as well. Who knows, if it, if it doesn't work, I can always just come back and try it. And we'll take one life shroom for funsies, but uh, I don't need two. We'll get the vault shroom too, because if you notice, the vault shroom in this actually gives you fast stats, which is actually really nice. And I guess I have room for one more. I just have a bunch of healing items, kind of. I kind of wish I grabbed a fire flower, but it should be fine. And I guess a slow shroom should be useful. Alright. Now we're gonna go tackle them blooper blooper. Bloopity blue boss. That was half me doing a joke accent and half me actually like kind of getting a little tipsy, let's say. Bonk. If you're curious, those blocks are uh, still there. The, the the ether block that was on top of the pipe to the Bogley Woods is actually gone. But the one that leads to, uh, whatchamacallit, or the, the Koopo Town place. I can't remember any names today. I'm like totally scatterbrained. The, that one was still blocked off, presumably because Bowser was there, I guess. Because it was still sort of plot relevant. I guess we'll have Goombella out first.
Sure. So we can at least tattle. Because this is, uh... I think she has a fair bit of HP. There you go. Oh, they have 30 HP. Dang. Okay, this does work on the tentacles. That's actually pretty nice. I guess since I'm going to swap her out, I might as well keep her up front. Actually, no, 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 no. What we can do is... Turn one slow stopper and then tattle and get star power. And, you know, try to actually not mess this up. Seriously, I'm going to concentrate for realsies. Ugh, okay. Hey, it actually worked. Although slow affecting... That's actually kind of funny, because I don't think that really does anything. Also, I can see its HP. I just realized, oh man, I can see its HP without tattling it. Well, I'm still going to tattle it for information. Drowsy Blooper does 7 damage. And it inflicts poison and slow. But it's weak to fire and explosions. Uh, I don't know if I feel comfortable multi-bonking. Fuck it. That was decent. Ow. There we go. Alright, now we're going to tattle again for the star power. And we'll swap her out to Flurry. Or not, because I just got my HP back, so why not attack again then? Why not? That's funny, actually. That's actually a hell of a time to get uh, a thing. Yeah, I have the piercing toes. So, you may have noticed that what we're going to do is the tentacles have a lot of HP. I don't remember if she... I think she actually might never bring the tentacles back. If she, like, does something. Like, if she, she... Once you knock her down, she doesn't go back up, I don't think. Maybe she does? I don't know. But, uh... Oh, sweet! Let's go. The idea is I'm going to take out this tentacle on the left here. Because the tentacles each have certain people they can hit, right? Tentacle on the left can hit either person, but the tentacle on the right can only hit the person in front, and it's just one hit. So, what I can do is kind of just keep somebody, I can take out the left tentacle and then just slowly whittle down the blooper while she's up top, and the, all that can happen is the right tentacle attacks the person in front, and that's it. Which makes it way more manageable, because I'm pretty sure once you knock her down, she goes like ballistic on you, right? She'll start, like, multi-attacking and stuff. So, like, it's definitely, like, can uh, definitely be worth, you know, being careful about that. Anyways, it's Earthquake. Because apparently this hits them all. Yeah, that's great. So, the tentacles can't be slowed, though, which is kind of unfortunate. But uh, I understand. Ow! The left one's also just kind of harder to guard in general, I feel like. I have to regular jump on this guy. Boom, there we go. Dead. Now we're just going to slowly whittle her down. Now, unfortunately, Flurry's a little uh, awkward to do her action command, because if I miss, it kind of sucks. But uh, I can basically just alternate partners and, like, placement and whatnot, because, like... I don't have to worry about, uh, like, being killed, you know what I mean? Like, th this is actually kind of, like, really cheesy, I guess, but, uh, you know, if you th I'm just playing smart, you know? And, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll put a slow stream on Mario. Seems like a good idea. Ah! Now I can swap back over to Mario, who's getting like 4 HP a turn. And we'll just start uh, slowly whittling down this blooper. 
Boom. I should probably throw out an art attack just so I'm not wasting my SP either. Nice! And also I have like lots of luck badges. Or like I have a lucky day I should say. It's like that's pretty nice in and of itself. Yeah, well, Art Attack the blooper and then Flurry can, like, heal, like, give it a nice suck, because I'm getting FP healing anyway, so. Only thing is, like, yeah, you can see, like, it's kind of, it's pretty big. Ah, that actually was not worth it in the slightest, but whatever. Oh, that's weird. Look how high up she just went. Whoa! What the heck? She froze it, but... It, it, like... That's kind of weird looking. Well, I guess that's fine. That did like what? Like 8 though? Like that's so much. But it's 8 FP, so like that's why. It's really strong. Dude, it's shrunk! Look how high up it is! That's so funny. Am I going to hit it? Yeah, I can, but like, man, it's so high up. I couldn't even do the stash, because that was so weird. Oh, her tentacles come back after a while, okay. That is good to know. Oh, yeah, give me that shit, baby. That's Thank you for that. I'm going to use that right now. Ah, oh, dude, that's so good. Okay. One turn of mobilization is all I need, man. Uh, I guess I'll just keep it going then. <laughs> of course. First time she activates in this fight and she... Well, I guess second time. Okay, the I mean, the first time was pretty useful. It's just funny she's activating on a turn where, like, the one turn they're actually immobilized. Uh, I guess I'll just... What I can do is Ice Storm. Only the big guy's frozen, so I'm not gonna bother. I'll, I'll just do this, then yeah. It's probably faster to not worry about the tentacles, but it is safer. Ah! Like, the left one is so hard to guard. Because, like, with the right one, it's basically press A the instant you see it move. But with the left one, it's like, you have to, like, wait a little bit. Uh, I guess I'm gonna... Sweet tree, yeah. Ah, oh, bugger, it went down so much fast. I'm still not used to how fast it is. Like, I'm getting better at it, but it's just like, ah! Oh. Sometimes I just do bad. Anyways, I think Floyd does six damage with her body slam now, right? Yeah, because she has the P down, D up, and the extra attack from the super rank. Ah, okay. It's It still, it still sometimes gets me. Uh, yeah, we'll just piercing throw then. I haven't missed this yet. I was missing this a lot, actually, when I was just, like, doing this off screen. It kept getting me. Hey, nice lucky. Oh! 
Honestly, defensive strats are so much better with Happy Heart being, like, predictable. With it just being 1 HP a turn. Like, you can... You actually see a lot of value in having, like, defensive setups. Uh... Hmm. You know what? Sure. Actually, we'll put her... Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do it. Fuck it. Give her some fast. She's doing more damage anyway, so it makes sense. Sure. I have all those, like, those power-up mushrooms. It's like, yeah, I don't really need them. Like, yeah, she's dead this turn. In fact, just for extra style... Bam! 8 0 damage! And then we're just gonna do this for funsies. Big damage! Don't crash! Wouldn't that be funny? That's that's interesting to note though. That still did 4 damage, so Super Rank did not change the damage of her blow attack at all. I think you can refight it though. Well, that's it then. That's everything in this game. I keep, I'm mashing B to go through the text, and it lets me hammer almost instantly. But yeah, that's everything there is to do in this ROM hack, in this mod, this package of a game. So that'll be it for this part. I'm not even going to bother saving, because I didn't get anything from that. And who knows, maybe I'll use, I don't know if this save file will be compatible when future chapters get released. But uh, yeah, no, that'll be it for this entire thing. Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. So yeah, see you guys later.